So it was requested that I make a video on how to connect more than one keyboard to main stage, and here it is. Let's take a look. Okay, begin by going into main stage and choosing File, New. And keyboard, I'm doing keyboard minimalist. You can also add this or modify any existing main stage concert you may have. If you start with File, New, you'll get a new keyboard here. You want to go to the Layout tab. And this will automatically detect anything on all channels, but you want to click Assign and begin playing on the keyboard that you'd like to use, and it will detect that this is an impulse on channel 1. And so that is your first keyboard. It's assigned and you can play. Um, you can assign these other controls as well. I'll link a video at the end on how to set up all your controls in main stage if you're interested in that. Then if you go down to the bottom here and choose another keyboard, drag and drop it onto the screen, and there it is. You can do the same for the pedals that go along with that keyboard. You can drop the secondary sustain pedal here if you want um, or other controls but we're not going to cover all those. We'll just do the main keyboard and you can watch the other video again for that how to set up the other controls. Then you're going to want to go over to assign and play your second keyboard. When I play this keyboard you can see that main stage again detects a different port, MVK Mini 2, channel 1. Now if you have keyboards on different ports coming in, which is typically the case, then this is pretty okay. You can have channel 1 from that port, and then if we click down here, we can see this was the impulse on channel 1. So there you go, now you have your second keyboard. Let's look at how to assign them to patches. If you click on Edit, choose whichever patch you'd like. I'll just use the default starter one we started with here. And if you click on the channel for the main sound of the patch, at this time, that channel is assigned to the keyboard on the bottom, the impulse. So that's what that's assigned to. We'll leave that one there. Let's add another channel for an additional sound. New instrument. And let's set the MIDI input on this one to MPK Mini. Instrument 2, let's choose the instrument we'd like to use for that. We'll go down here, let's say an organ. Let's do a B3, and we'll do Sol Organ. So that's the sound there. Now, if I go and play the smaller keyboard, back to the impulse, and then both together. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I've linked a couple of videos up here that you can check out. Like and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this. And I uh, hope you enjoy. Have a good day.